It's a really exciting time to be treating HER2 positive metastatic breast cancer because of the many therapeutic options we now have available for our patients. Um, the standard of care is really to treat patients in the frontline setting with trastuzumab, pertuzumab, and ataxane. Um, the taxane is given for four to six cycles, and then patients go on to maintenance, trastuzumab and pertuzumab. And that's the gold standard based on the Cleopatra study, which showed a significant improvement in overall survival with that triplet strategy. Um, and the second gold standard is second line use of trastuzumab emtansine, the antibody drug conjugate that targets HER2. Um, this is the gold standard based on the Amelia study. So there aren't a whole lot of questions at this point in time about what you should treat your newly diagnosed HER2 positive metastatic breast cancer patient with or what you should treat a second line patient with. Um, after that, we have multiple different therapeutic options we can utilize, including lipatinib-based therapy, trastuzumab plus chemotherapy, or trastuzumab plus lipatinib. Um, and while we have several treatment options available, including lipatinib, trastuzumab, pertuzumab, and TDM1, there are myriad therapies that are in clinical trials right now.